Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hi, if you're new here, I'm Imshita, please subscribe and join my journey on YouTube and let's get on with today's video. Okay, so as you guys must have read by the title, we're going to be testing a bunch of coffee flavors in this video and I'm so excited for this journey. So basically what I did was, uh, one day I was just sitting in my room and I was like, oh, I'm missing that mocha frappe from Starbucks. And I was like, I wish mocha hum ghar pe bana sakte. So I was like, wait a minute, you dummy. We got Bezo Bhaiya, we got the internet. Definitely koi to bech raoga. And I searched it and it's like such a common thing and I felt so stupid. But basically I was like, oh my God, there's a whole world of coffee flavors out here. And I was just sleeping on it the entire time. So I was like, we need to try some. And since I'm like a very mocha coffee person, I ordered two packs which have four flavors each. And I ordered one more. So I got this Colombian brew assorted instant coffee powders. So the first one I got as strong vanilla, hazelnut and caramel. And the other one I got strong double chocolate, mint and blueberry. So those are our flavors. And I ordered the mocha frappuccino or mocha cappuccino uh, that Nestle sells. So that. So we have a total of eight flavors to test in this video. And I'm so excited for you guys to see it. By the way, watch till the end of this video for a giveaway. Mm, I got a giveaway for you. This is my first YouTube giveaway. I'm so excited. So watch till the end for the giveaway details. And now let's get started. Hey guys, it's trial number one. So today we are trying this. It's the Chocomoka by Nescafe Gold. And I got a new mug today. Super cute, right? I think it's super cute. So this says to mix it in water, but no sister, I cannot. Mama needs milk, so I'm gonna be doing that. Smells like drinking chocolate and cocoa powder, to be very honest. Smells really nice though. Guys, we have Anushka. Dude, look at this. Okay, Anushka is joining us for the taste testing. You wanna go first? Kita minute la guy. Gas for don't get the dude. I don't know. It's nice, but I feel like the ratio is a bit off. It's nice. Yeah. I like it. So at least I know when I'm using this cup, one and a half. Nice. This. Taste it, please. Nice. Huh? Yeah. I like it. Okay. So guys, this coffee gets an 8 on 10. I know, right? Normally I'm very nice to things, but this time I actually want to like analyze. So this one definitely gets an 8 on 10. It's nice. Is what I would like to say. What are your thoughts? It's nice. It's, <laughs> it's more like... Yeah, like it's a mocha, right? So like it's more it's on the mocha. yeah, exactly. So it's right there on the box, Anushka. <laughs> so it's a mocha. So as a mocha, it's very tasty. It's but it's more on the chocolatey side of it because it's a choco <laughs> yes. mocha. But it's not it's a not your favorite mocha. Tea. It's a choco mocha. Okay, then it's fine. It like as the name to suggests, be it is chocolate chocolatier. Chocolate You don't need any sugar in this guy. Yeah, no. No, no, no. So yes, this was our coffee number one and I will get back to you guys once we receive the rest of the coffees. And hopefully we'll froth be out We'll see you then. Hey guys, today we are testing flavor number two. So basically, my Colombian brew order came in. It comes like this. So we got our caramel, hazelnut, vanilla, and strong. So let's go with this. Wild vanilla one. 
serving instant coffee. This is the mug I'm using this time. So I hope this will quantity say it. This says that this sachet is good for 200 ml of mm, water milk. Now I don't, I don't know about all that. So I'm just gonna use this. Beat it, beat it, beat it, beat it, beat it. It smells like that toffee. Alpenliebe. It smells exactly like Alpenliebe. Let's see how it goes. So I'm pretty sure we're gonna need to add sugar into this. Cheers guys. Coffee number two. Not bad. It Okay, so wild vanilla tastes like Alban Libre flavored coffee. So if you're into that, you're gonna like this. I find it okay, but not a fan. I don't know if I would like make this or buy this by itself. You know, I like it better now. It's growing on me. Hmm. actually like it okay i was gonna give this a six on ten but considering i gave the nest the last one i had the mocha an eight i would like to change that to a nine please so that's a nine this is a seven definitely a seven this is good hey guys so this is it for this coffee i'll catch you guys with the next one it's time to test out the next coffee this is double chocolate um there are a lot of people in the kitchen and like a lot of noise over there so i'm gonna get the coffee and record it over here okay guys i think i've done the same thing again too much milk because i can't taste shit it smells like cocoa powder. I'm not kidding. It smells like cocoa powder. Like when I'm making a cake, cocoa powder or drinking chocolate? One of those two. Drinking chocolate, I think. By the way, Vlogmas has started. I'm so excited. Um, this is going on like simultaneously. Still no taste. How much do I need to put? I'm just putting the entire thing. So this coffee gets a 5 on 10 from me, It even after the sugar, it tastes just okay, nothing great, it's very, mm. so yeah, 5 or 10 for double chocolate. So I'm gonna see you guys when I try the next flavor. Hey guys, another day, another coffee. Today we're trying mint chocolate. Smells really nice. I wasn't very excited about it, but it smells really nice. So I'm excited about it. Strange. Tastes a little strange. I'm gonna have to put sugar in this too. I've been trying these without sugar for like first goes, but I don't know why. I think I need to add sugar to all these coffees. I can't drink coffees without sugar. I'm back with the sugar added. Much better. Hmm. It's interesting. It's interesting. I've never had mint chocolates, like confession. <laughs> so I don't know what I was expecting out of this. It actually <laughs> This is reminding me of my shampoo guys. Like the aftertaste reminds me of my shampoo. Because that's when you get the minty thing in your mouth. When you drink it, it just tastes like coffee. Interesting is what I would say. So I'd give this 7. It's not bad. It's interesting. 7. Seven's not a bad score, I feel. Yeah. 7. Happy coffee. I'll see you with the next one. Hey guys, today's coffee is nutty hazelnut. 
I'm excited to try it. Like my froth has still settled down because I've like <laughs> the eight and I've been trying to drink it. Look at that. Anushka's froth turned out so yes, you good. Like an ASMR. <laughs> so good. I finally figured out how to use the froth properly. Aren't you proud? I'm proud. Hey guys, not the best lighting in all today. Really tired in the process of shifting. Mmm, I really like it. I really like it. It's actually really nice. I honestly had no expectations of actually liking this one. I was very, let's just get it over with about it earlier. But it's actually really nice. I will give this a 7.5. Or eight, somewhere there. But definitely really nice. Like, I really like it. So, yeah. I'll see you guys with the next one. Hey, guys. Another day, another coffee. Or maybe you've already seen this. But today we're testing caramel, creamy caramel. Let's go. So I already tried this once and it was pretty bad. Now that it has the extra sachet and sugar, let's give it another shot. Hopefully it won't be as bad because none of the coffees have been like bad till now. Okay, yeah. Caramel is definitely not my flavor. Oh, really? No. I think that's my worst rating yet. Well. One week later. It was amazing. It was so good. I think it was one of the best ones I've had. I would rate it a 9 on 10. Amazing. I loved it. I really loved it. It was so, so, so good. Like, so good. So, total 10 on 10. 9 on 10. 9.5 on 10. I can give it a 10 on 10. It was really good and i'm not a fan of caramel i thought i won't like it i was honestly surprised that i liked it so much but yeah creamy caramel was a super hit so yeah that was creamy caramel's review so my mistake i have deleted the footage from testing out the blueberry flavored coffee blueberry chocolate coffee it was nice it was really different like really really different nothing like all the flavors i've tried yet um it's nice but the aftertaste is really blueberry like it really is so i don't know if it's everyone's cup of coffee but it is good like my mom really liked it so if you like that after you will like it it's not bad so i would give it like a i don't remember what i gave it but i would give it like a 7 on 10 only because i didn't personally like it if i liked that aftertaste i would definitely give it like a 9 on 10 it was good just not my cup of coffee <laughs> and i'll see you guys with the next one hello friends today we are testing out the last flavor that is remaining in our coffee journey which is their classic strong coffee let's go let's test it out and let's find out how it is okay so we've tasted all the coffees we have rated all of them but now let's rank all of them into one like ultimate ranking okay so number one will definitely be creamy caramel definitely definitely loved that one loved it. it was so good so surprising and so good next would definitely be um wild vanilla yes loved it would definitely reach out more to it third would have to be the instant coffee flavor i recently tried this like today it was so good i was so surprised long would definitely be number three even though i don't want to put a number three because i want to like rank the flavors itself but this has to go number three i liked it so much i like it better than nescafe and david off 
I feel like this is my favorite like regular coffee flavor I've tried so far which is weird but it's actually so good wow did not see that coming when I tried this flavor anyway coming back to the rankings uh, number four would be mint because that was really interesting number five would be um the hey guys editor Ipshita here so now that i've spent a lot of time with these coffees i want to change the rankings a little bit so number four go to hazelnut definitely number five would be mint chocolate number six would go to choco mocha the nescafe one number seven would be the double chocolate one and actually the number seven would be uh, blueberry chocolate even though it's not my taste i think it, like it's a good coffee for someone who's into that flavor and the last would be double chocolate because that was actually slightly disappointing it was dull so yeah these are my updated rankings so now let's get to the giveaway you guys this is my first giveaway on youtube i'm so excited so the winner is gonna get the instant coffee bags like one of the combos all you have to do is subscribe to my channel follow me on instagram and comment down below which flavor you are excited to try the most and do leave your, your insta id for me to reach out to you in case you win so i'll be picking a winner last week of feb and yeah i'm so excited to do this and i'm so excited for you to try these coffees because some of them were so good okay guys that's it that's it and that's it for today's video i hope you enjoy like share and subscribe i will see you guys in the next one till then take care and i love you guys bye